magnification of your smartphone screen, both Android and iPhone. But just for you to know, if it doesn't work for you, it's the settings that count. So on the Android, you would go into your settings, accessibility, visibility enhancements, and magnification. And let me show you what it looks like on an Android to start with. This happens to be my Samsung Note 9. It might be different on yours. Who knows? If I tap with one finger three times. One, two, three. Oh, come on. <laughs> one, two, three. There. It magnifies the screen. Now I need two fingers to drag around to the different parts of the screen. To turn it off, it's the same way that I turned it on. One, two, three. And now it's back to normal. And this works anywhere. I can be inside of Facebook. One finger, one, two, three, taps. Now it takes two fingers to move around. And one, two, three, to go back. So that's magnifying the screen on an Android. And those settings, if you swipe down and tap the little gear, you get into settings, accessibility. <laughs> accessibility, visibility enhancements, and magnification. Triple tap screen to magnify is what it says here. And you could turn that off. Now, that's one thing. Some people do this by accident and they say, what the f is that? You know, I don't like that. So you can go into your settings and turn it off if you don't like it. All right. iPhone. With iPhone, it's three fingers and double tap. And then you use the same three fingers to scroll around. Wow, that's really... Now, this magnification is huge. If you want the magnification, but not quite that much, first of all, three fingers, double tap, puts it back to normal. But then it's three finger, double tap, and hold down. Then you can drag up and down to change the magnification level. Three fingers, double tap. Drag up, drag down, get the magnification of right where you want it. Now you can drag around three fingers, double tap to turn it off. And if you don't like that at all, it's in settings and accessibility and zoom. And you just turn it off from now on you will never be able to accidentally turn on Zoom.